Brothers took a stupid gamble and paid $450 for this storage unit right here. Look at this. Yeah, not much, but you know what? I like mystery boxes, I like gambling. Let's go see if we made a good choice. I think this box right here kinda is for you. If what it says is true, it says hangers on the box. I kinda hope it's not, but if it is, then I got you an early birthday present. Oh yeah! <gasps> Look! Wow! This is an early that's birthday present for you. So amazing, thank there you, you, you so know what? much. I'm gonna take it home so I can rewrap it and everything like that. Okay, but, okay. Okay, this one, oh no. You're not supposed to tell me. Uh, well, sorry. I, I was just so excited about the gift. I felt I had to tell you. Let's go in here. This one says clothes, but we don't know what kind of clothes. It could be new clothes. It could be all used clothes. We don't know. It could be designer. It could be Ross. Ooh, a hat. What is that? Uh, why do I feel like it's, this is from Avatar? No. Yeah, is no. it from an anime? I don't I know. Would, the horn makes me think anime, guys. Let me know in the comments. If it's not Dragon Ball, I don't know. Another hat. What else is in there? Oh, there's more than just clothes down there. There's a picture frame, another picture frame, and yeah, all the rest of it is just clothes. So most likely, unless it's designer, we're just gonna donate that. This box actually does say jewelry box on it right there. And this one says shoe boxes. So you know what? Mm, let's go to the, this one. This one says dresser knickknacks. That okay. could be so random. That could be really worthless little things that have sentimental value, or it could be gold coins, you know? Yeah. No idea. Let's rip it open and see. Well, you know, we probably should have brought a knife for this one, but we always forget. He's work just as good. You know, I feel like every time, listen, every time we bring a knife, it gets left in the previous unit. That does. It does. I see a phone. Well, we got a Samsung something there. I don't know how that's a knickknack, but hey, it's a phone. Puzzle, notebook, bam, bam. Hey. Bam, bam. Some little Mario character, a little beanie baby frog, a mug that says. Uh, I don't know. My truth? My truth. There's no such, no, I'm not gonna go in. There's no such thing as a particular truth. Two plus two is four. <laughs> That's just the way it works. We got wood stock and a bunch of little stuffed animals in there, so kinda cool. Let's go to the box that just says shoe boxes because, okay, that sounds good. I don't know if they're gonna be empty shoe boxes or they're gonna be boxes with shoes in them because they don't specify shoes. You Definitely know? hope there's shoes yeah, in them. If they just put a box full of shoe boxes, man, right. man. I'm gonna find this person to fight with. Because it makes no sense to like package yeah, just exactly. shoe boxes. I do see some Nike, it looks like, though. So that's a good thing. If there are even shoes, the moment of truth. Oh, what is that? That's not even shoes. That is a little bottle of what? Some liquor? Champagne. Or a ring pop? Okay, what is this? The Yankee candle. Oh. That okay. just comes with it. I uh, thought it was um, a gift card. <laughs> no. Random, but okay. Let's see. What's in here? I'll save Nike for last. Well, I can say this one's over. This silver slipper. Well, they're in there. Bounty ball. That's a good sign. Yes. Here you go. There we go. Thank you. you I'm not going to make the <laughs> no. joke. I'm not going to make the joke. I'm not going to make it. I, I didn't even pay attention to I Silver it. slipper. <laughs> silver slipper. Sorry. Oh, uh, well. Oh, that's not good. Poor Anna. Come on, man. Nike box. Come on, Nike box. Come on, Nike box, please. Please. <laughs> Definitely not Nike. Yeah, these are the weirdest looking Nikes I've ever seen. <laughs> Hot tomato. Okay. Some big old heels. Okay, so those. So what's that? Duckbill clips for two bucks. Okay. Yeah. Highlighter. I love wearing these as shoes. And then <laughs> that. Uh, not too sure what that is. Listen to the sound of this one. Definitely sounds random. Let me get my little key knife here because this is all yes. we have. That's for that's what we should get. A knife that goes on the keychain. A chain. keychain knife. Yes. We, we need one of those for never every forget. key. We need it for every single key set we have, so we always have a knife with us. Then we have to go on Amazon. We no help. kidding. <laughs> we had one before too, a while back. I remember. Okay. Well, oh. this is school supplies. Brand new. Brand new markers. Brand new glue sticks. Some crayons, staplers, staple ammo, <laughs> pencils, and yeah, that's all school supplies. This stuff right here is most likely, we're just gonna donate as well with the clothes. This got a little more exciting. Not only do we have the box that says jewelry box, I just realized this box over here, both of them say DVDs and games. So if there's games in there with the DVDs, I'm gonna assume they're video games because that's the same thing. This one just says fragile, it does say pictures. Let's see if it's actually pictures. What if it's framed autograph pictures? Oh, maybe there's Jimmy Dean turkey sauce. Oh boy, I would just love expired turkey sausage. You know what, that would make my day. <laughs> make my day. Ugh, well, based, okay, you know, I see a mix. I see some superhero stuff, but I also see a lot of personal pictures, so the personal ones we're gonna leave behind, of course. But I see, like, this marble underneath of it, look. That's cool. That's pretty sick, there's Batman, too. 
Like right here, look. Ugh. Come here, Batman. There's a Batman There's two. one. Is it two over there? They stuck together. Oh, there's... oh, look. That's just how they were on the wall. So we have Spider Man and Batman. Those are cool. What else do we have in here? Personal pictures. Uh, these are just like, you know, wall decor. Just, oh gosh, that's so cringy. Just designer <laughs> brands. So cringe in Chanel. But these will sell at our yard sale and they'll get the personal pictures back. So I sliced this one open ahead of time because, well, it's getting on my nerves. And we got, yes, this is what we came for. It's a costume. A cat, it's brand new. Wow. Cat in a hat. You know what? That, that's worth the money right there. <laughs> but this box is like weirdly heavy. So I feel like there's something underneath all the clothes. But there's a ton of clothes in here. No, really? Well, prove me wrong. It's clothes all the way down. So again, we'll go through them, see what we can find. But most likely if it's just meh stuff, donations. Let's go into one of these DVD game boxes and see if we have uh, some video games inside of it. Or what kind of games they can mean. Because what other games go with DVDs, right? Right. Yeah. Come on. Well, there's DVDs for sure. I see green cases. I see green cases too, but they're DVD cases. Well, what's that one? Where? What do you see? Oh, look, there's a video Xbox case in there. We got, what is that? NBA 2K6 with Shaq one. And when he played with the Miami Heat. Man, okay, I see some Xbox games under here. Look right here. Oh, nice. yeah. Okay, so we have Troll, Killing Floor 2, Resident Evil 3, Resident Evil 2, Overwatch, all Xbox One. That's good. I see more in there too. Oh, yeah. There's a ton of video games down here. This is a Steelbook game. What game is that? Uh, Doom Eternal for Xbox One. That's good too. What are these right here? Oh yeah, we got, oh, Castlevania for PlayStation One. If you're wondering why that makes me so happy, it's because that one single game sells from between $120 and $160 on its own. And it's in there. The disc, the jewel case is a little broken. Doom, Titanfall, FIFA 17. Ooh, oh my, right here. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh. Let's go. And there's DSi or down there. DS 3DS. Look at that. Murdered, Injustice, World War Z, Metal Gear Survive, Do Sex, Madden 16. Nice. Nice. Woo! I'm so happy now. <laughs> Skate 3, Borderlands, Black Ops 3. These are the cases that make me nervous. I think like maybe one in a hundred the games in there. They're never in here. Hey, hey! It's actually in there! 3DS Animal Crossing. Let's go! Alright, let's move some more DVDs out the way. Plus, DVDs usually go for like 50 cents a piece, so. Black Ops 3, you can hear that in there. Dead Rising, uh, that's Usher. Uh, sure. uh, what is that? Ooh, Mortal Kombat Trilogy for the PlayStation 1, along with Batman 2 for 3DS. More 3DS games, Batman again. Uh, Angry Birds, let's see, DVDs. Mortal Kombat. More DVDs, Troll, and these are all DVDs. Zombie Land, that's a great movie. I'm gonna move these around. You see any more video game cases? Oh, yeah, look. One right there. There's a couple, I think. Oh, that was just a DVD. <laughs> Bang. Infinity, right there. There is Sonic Unleashed. What system is that for? The Wii. Yep. Then Doom 3, which is a 360 Xbox One combo. Man, the skate. There's a lot of video games in here. I gotta just go down this other side now really quick. Anything over there you see? Oh, they're all black cases. We don't know. Yep. No, these are all DVDs. There's a couple more games at the bottom. Look at that. Connect Adventures and Cars for Wii. That is an awesome box. Instead of going to the other games box, which I feel like could be a jackpot too, let's go to this unmarked only one with duct tape. Uh, what was that? <laughs> I don't know. I just saw something move. I don't like that. <laughs> oh, gosh. Uh-oh. Heart rate's up now. Let's see. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Be good to me. Maybe it was just dust. Maybe it was just dust. Fingers crossed. Oh! What? It's, look in there! Oh, my gosh. No way. <laughs> look at that. Whoa. Holy, you know what? These are all games, aren't they? Well, this isn't right here. This is oh, what? original oh, PlayStation and a PS2. It oh looks my like. gosh! Look at this. All workout stuff. Yeah, these are all workout stuff. I'm allergic to those, so I don't <laughs> want to get sick. Let's put them over here. Don't tell me these are PlayStation One games. Oh my gosh! PS One? Are you joking? The demo, demo. What is that? Issues. These are demo discs. Are these like collectible? I'd imagine so. A lot of those are demo. Let's see. Look, demo. Oh my gosh! Stone Cold. There is a NBA game, demo. What is that one? It's a PS2 magazine. I feel like some of these could be rare. They're really random. 
Mm. Oh, look. That game. I feel like, I think this is a score. I think this is a major score. HBO Boxing, Game Day, Racing Game, Back to the Front. This is sick. Most of those games were about $10 or so a piece, but this Mortal Kombat one was another $50 to $60 game. Easy, 150 bucks for all of them. Oh my God. Uh, NBA Live, yeah. I mean, a lot of PlayStation 1 games, Nightmare Creatures. I feel like I bet you one of these are gonna be worth money. You know, when we bid on this unit, the only thing I had to go off of, that was the only box that was readable that said games on it. That's it. And we went for it. And here we are. PlayStation 1, right there. Look at that. Let's see if it's anything in there. Mm. Oh, Smackdown. A little <laughs> dusty. It probably hasn't been used in a long time, but that's okay. We'll clean it up. That is what I thought was the PS2, but this is just the adapter. So hopefully the PS2 is under all this. Look at all these controllers. Mad Cat controllers. You know why these bring back so many memories? These are the cheap alternatives for people like me that were kids and raged and broke their controllers. You can get these a lot cheaper. <laughs> that. Then look over here. Another PlayStation 1? Another one. Another PlayStation 1, an in-box PlayStation 2 piece right there. Another PS1, what's this over here? That is maybe uh, something to do with the PS2 as well. You can see the porch on it and everything. Yeah. But man, there's probably 50, not 50, but probably 10 to 15 controllers in there. Wow, that is awesome. Okay, that one says games. We're gonna skip it for now. Let's look at one that sounds a little more boring and see if it's the truth. This one says books and school supplies. We're gonna cut it open to see if they're telling the truth or if they're lying. And if you haven't already left this video a thumbs up, what in the world are you doing? Because this unit is awesome. Freaking awesome so far. And of course, subscribe if you're not already because we buy storage units all the time. Well, so far, it looks like it's telling the truth. I see markers. What's this though? This giant Macy's random box is heavy. I don't think that's school supplies. Let's open it up and find out what it is. Come on. What in the heck is this? Oh, it's a freaking poker thing. Or like, again, it's got poker chips, cards, dice, things like that. I don't even know Macy's would sell something like that, but okay. Uh, let's see. Well, I see, is there more games in here? School supplies, uh-huh. Look at these school supplies right here. Do you ever need Madden 01 for school? Game day, oh, Resident Evil 2 for school? Tekken! Oh my gosh. Fear effect, I don't know about that one, but the other ones, what the heck? Silent of the Hill? Slitcher? Slither. Okay, I thought it was a CH in there. Uh, the rest of it does look like school supplies, but I don't think I ever needed these for school. What about you? That Resident Evil 2 PlayStation game, $70. The Tekken PlayStation game, about $30. And that last Fear Effect one was about $40. Score again. I'm not liking what I see written on this box. It says wigs. Yeah. We're gonna put it over here. These are pretty common storage units. So I feel like, I don't know about people that wear wigs, but are there people that buy them and wear them like maybe one time because they were, you know, this special event or something, and then they just do it that way. And then it just goes to storage, like this. Yeah, well, I think this is exactly what it says it is. This is a whole thing of wigs and the head for the wigs. So at least the heads are there. This one says summer clothes, but we're already finding video games in the school supplies box, so I don't trust the word it says personally. We're gonna open it up and see what's inside anyway. Well, it is closed on top, but that doesn't mean it's not something buried, like that wallet. Uh-huh, see? Oh, oh, oh. Well, it was still, oh, uh, there's a back section. Come on, open up, open up, <laughs> please. No, nah, nothing in there. Well, let's see. Close, close. There's a hair dryer down there and a, what is that book bag? Philadelphia 676. Oh, it's an NBA one. Yeah, you're right. Look down here. This might be old. Nice. Let's see if there's anything inside though. Come on. Please, please, please. No, but it does look nice. I bet you it's got some value on its own. Let's go down here. More hangers. Brand new though. What, the hangers? Yeah. There's a little <laughs> purse. Anything in there? No, it's empty. Hair dryer, nothing, nothing, nothing. Yeah, all the rest, unfortunately, is closed. Let's go into the one that says shoe boxes and jewelry box on it because I'm really curious what's in the jewelry box because if they have collector games like that, there very well might be some gold chilling in here too waiting for us. Let's see. So we got some books. This right here says Madden Girl. Oh, it's just a bunch of random bathroom what stuff. What? What's the 8-bit thing? It like, looks like the Joker from, um, what's it called, Harley? Harley Quinn. Quinn yeah. Hill. Yeah, this is all bathroom stuff. Let's put this down here. What about this? Right here. Uh, more hair and wig accessories. 
What are these? Are these shoe boxes? They are, but it doesn't sound like shoes in them, that's for sure. Hey, tissues, I need that. Thank you. <laughs> uh, random little, what are these butterflies? Ooh. What? That. Uh, yeah, well, <laughs> probably shouldn't touch that. No. But it might have just been tobacco or, you know, yeah. green. That's a little watch. Nothing else that I'm seeing in there. Put that, that in knife? there. No, where? I didn't see a knife. Right here. Oh, it is a little bit. Hey. Yay! <laughs> I got a tissues and a knife. We're resourceful. Yay. This is all about scavenging, right? I feel like yeah. I'm playing Fallout. <laughs> searching for the toys in there, the I supplies need this. I need. Hey, look. Nice pair of shoes in the box. Nice. That's pretty good. What about this box? Come here. Come here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oop, another nice pair. Oh, look. There's the receipt. Let's see how this brand is. Oh, well. $19.99. <laughs> yeah, Not man. too expensive. They could have got them on discount. Yeah. What about this? little purse oh it's got a phone or it a phone case let's see no it's a phone mm -hmm. another crack to death phone but hey it's still a phone people buy them for parts nothing else in there this right here nothing it's empty oh i think i see the jewelry box look there it is there it is Ooh, sounds Ooh. nice let's get there hold on let's keep going through here first what's the black a little thing? light what's that toy this yeah um let's see <laughs> open up what the heck are these? Oh, they, oh, I thought they were Tamagotchis at first. Scrabble, Scrabble Flash. Flash, okay. Never heard of that, nope. but okay. Set that right here. We're gonna set this aside. Ooh, ooh look, Air Forces. We'll get over there. First, what's this? Anything in this purse? Envelopes and hair stuff. This right here, is this a laptop or tablet? Nope, just a notebook. This, mm, paperwork. All right, what's in the Nike box? Oh, very random, some little basketballs. Uh, what a Minecraft Lego set? Look at that. That's kind of cool. <laughs> what about this case here? Uh, nothing. All right, well, there's only one thing left to do, isn't there? Yeah. What do you think's in there? Gold? Gold? Come on, Gold. come on, come on. Ooh, well, definitely potential. Let's see. Some earrings. These aren't. Ooh, what's the watch right here? <laughs> Check that out. XOXOXO. That looks super nice right there. Let's see what else we got in here. Another little watch. What's this big old coin? Come here. That is, what, USS Mesa Verde? Maybe a ship, it looks like. Yeah, definitely some type of ship. Then, some other little random jewelry in here. It doesn't look like it's gold or anything, but still, jewelry is jewelry. The funny thing is, when I bid on this unit, I couldn't even tell it said board games. All I could read because of the shadow was games. And the funny thing is, it's been full of awesome video games, so let's open the box that made us bid on the unit right here for all the wrong reasons because I couldn't even see it. Let's see. Now we have a knife. Thank you, unit. <laughs> and I got to blow my nose. Thank you, unit. Whoa. It does say board games, and that's what we got. Seal, Family Feud. Sorry. You're in trouble. Uh, Barnum and Bailey. That's a personal picture. I'll put that back in there. Uh, words with friends. It's just called Scrabble. Uh, puzzles. Some type of Monopoly voice banking down there. It's too advanced. I like paper money. Steve Harvey. Saved that show, by the way. Uh, Avengers, Puzzle, Scrabble, a whole bunch of most likely just, you know, throw it out the yard sale. Probably 10, 15 bucks in that box. I don't know why it's 92 degrees in this facility, but it is hot. This one just has school supplies again. We got to check it because, well, last time they had rare PlayStation 1 games in their school supplies box. So I don't trust anything that's written on these boxes. Well, we see index cards, notebook paper, markers, pencils, more paper, more paper, hordes of paper, hordes. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, this one's not lying. This is pretty much all new school supplies, which again, will be donated to a school. Two more mini boxes here. School supplies on the top one. The next one just says binders. Does that mean school supplies binders? You're like Pokemon cards? Because they're into video games and that's the same audience. The video games, card people, usually are intertwined. Let's Cross look your in fingers here. for Pokemon. Please, Pokemon. Uh, well, these are just a bunch of, these will remind me of like the books you used to get in the groups in elementary school, you know? Yeah. Uh, notebooks, school supplies, that's all school stuff right here. Come on, binders. Come on, binders. Binders of Pokemon cards. Please, 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 please. Please, 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 I'm begging you, box. I'm begging you, box. There we go. I see the binder. What's in it? Oh, it's empty. What about this one? No, they're all empty. So again, they'll probably go with the rest of the stuff as a donation. Which box do you think? All the way in the corner says school supplies or this one that just says backpack scrabble shoes? I want that one. This guy? Yeah. All right, let's see. Ooh. I believe scrabble. Like, <laughs> I, I hear those wood tiles shaking around. I just know that's got to be what it is. So let's but it also said shoes, so. Yeah, that's true, too. Maybe we could find some Jordans? 
hopefully. We found a lot of video games, so I'm happy so far. Found two Nike boxes, no Nike. I know. Well, there's your first pair of like dress shoes. So there are shoes. I think I might see a tablet. Is that a tablet? Ooh, look at that. A nice tablet too. Let's take it out of the case and see what it says on the back. I don't know if it's an iPad or what. It's an Amazon, so okay. not as expensive as Apple, but hey, it's at least usable now. Bag. This is, eh, come here. Big old scrabble up. Here we go again, two more Nike boxes. Can we get one this time? <laughs> Heck of that. It is not allowed to get this Nike, I don't think. No. One more Nike box right here, I think. Yep. Can we? No, oh, no. Oh my gosh, that weight is right. A Nintendo 3DS XL, come on. Oh my gosh, really? Trucks, trucks. Uh, well, you got me. Is that all that was in there? Yeah, that's all that was in there. Dang it. Normally, I would just open these book boxes off camera and check, but the fact that we've already found video games inside one of them, you gotta be here for the excitement too, you know? It's no fun if I'd be like, I opened this, this is what I found. That's boring. <laughs> you gotta be along for the ride with us. Let's see. Well, this one does look like a ton of books. Manila envelopes, books, books, books. Is that a comic? I might see a comic book. Eh, kind of, I guess, kind of in the middle. But most of this, again, school books that we'll just drop off at a donation center. Still twitching at that game box, but you know what? I'm going to practice patience today. I'm going to practice patience. Oh, By Lord. the way, we looked up, <laughs> I looked up, I scanned one of the PS2, PS1 games, sorry. Uh -huh. Resident Evil is like a $65 game, one. I didn't even look through the rest, so there's going to be some money in there for sure. Let's slice this one open. It says books, but again, I don't believe it because isn't that where we found the Resident Evil at? Pretty sure it was the book box. So let's check it out. Well, thesaurus, books, books. More books. Okay, there's some like comic type books what in there. What is that? That is a comic book? It's a comic kinda, type book. Yeah, like a comic type book. But some oh. of these could still be worth a little bit. But most of the ones that are just for kids in elementary schools, I feel better just donating than trying to sell for a few bucks. This says red bubble coat and blue guest coat. What brand is the red bubble coat? Like that can mean, again, I feel like I said this earlier, $10 coat from Ross or $500 designer jacket from who knows where. So. I guess we should pop it open and Very see true. what it is. There it is. It's right, all right. Let me see the infamous red bubble coat. This is, what's that brand say? A New uh, Day. A New Day? That doesn't help me at all. It's made in Vietnam. This guy right here, this blue one, it says guess, but I'm gonna check behind them because they lie sometimes. And no, it's guess, it does say guess on there. It's a nice coat. But a nice blue coat with a little fur on the hood. This one says Wallace brown coat, and then the moment I've been waiting for, I can dig into that box. I just know there's gonna be more PlayStation games in there. Please, let's see. Wallace brown coat, what you got for me? I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna guess, that was weird, I spelled cursive. I'm gonna guess <laughs> that it's a brown coat with the brand Wallace. That's my guess, you know, it's just an educated guess. It's pretty random. <laughs> this is, well, it's a brown coat, and then, Brooklyn Express. Brooklyn, See, Brooklyn. they lie to me. This thing's huge, like really. What really is the huge. size? It was like a 4X, wasn't it? Yeah, it's a 4XL. This thing could fit me. Man, I don't know what if the brand Brooklyn is expensive. If you know, let us know in the comments. The moment we've all been waiting for. At least I have. I wonder if you have too. Hopefully, the <laughs> DVD slash game box. This is gonna be the money right here. We'll have more of it because we already got a ton of it in this unit. All right, this one's looking a little tall, so maybe I should lower the box. Let's put it on top of this one. All right. So you guys can see it better. Good deal. Now, see DVDs, but just like last time, 21 Jump Street. We got to get through the DVDs to find the games. Well, these are all DVDs. I'll play two. I saw that in there, too. And Bride of Chucky, Chucky. And see the Chucky. Chucky. <laughs> I love Chucky. You want your childhood ruined? Go look up the, um, the guy that played Chucky in Child's Play 1 and look up what he's getting arrested for right now. <laughs> My childhood was ruined for that. 300. 300, one of the greatest movies of all time. This, I see game cases though. They're down here, they're way down there. But look at all these DVDs too. There's a lot I mean, of DVDs. Like 50 cents a piece or so. This is still a lot of cash too right here. I just really want to find the video games, I really do. And they decided to store them all the way at the bottom. I got one, Jeez. look at that. Okay, what do we have here? We got Borderlands 2, but 500 DVDs on top of it. There they are. We have, hey, look. Goku and Cooler, or Cell. Nice. The best of Goku, nice. Mm -hmm. Left 4 Dead 2, Claudia of the Chance of Meatballs, that. I see the Xbox One games over here, look. Ugh, come out. Is that, look, Avatar. There is. Complete series. Yeah, there's Left 4 Dead and Mortal Kombat. But down here, these are all Xbox One games, aren't they? Yep, 
Geometry Wars, uh, that Ink Machine, ba Rage 2, Gears 5, Witcher 2, that's a good game. And Battleborn. Uh, look down there, you see this? There's why two. Do, I know, why are they stored like this? They're just tempting me, aren't they? Yeah, there it is. Streets, uh, what is that? Streets of Rage. Crash Bandicoot. Nice. Is there any in this stack right here? Doesn't look like it, but what a jackpot of a storage unit. 